What was your reaction on the 7th of October when Hamas invaded Israel? What do you think about these kind of comparisons between Israelis and the Nazis? Accurate, to be honest. Accurate, completely accurate. Can you explain how they're accurate, the ways in which they're accurate? Okay, so, I mean, fine, maybe you've got explanations on the back. A lot of people at these marches, we've seen signs, uh, you know, heard people talking, comparing Israel to the Nazis. What, what do you think of those kind of comparisons? I think that is a fair comparison. Palestinians welcomed all the Jews and gave them homes and all the necessary needs to make them feel settled and safe. But what did they decide to do is the question. We so, all welcomed them with open arms and then look what happened now, you know. What was your reaction on the 7th of October when Hamas invaded Israel? That it has been so long that they've been suffering that, I, I mean, it was the only way. They, they, they couldn't find any other way just to show that, that they needed to do something to show the world that we need to support their cause. What Israel is doing is far worse because their governing ideology puts Jewish people uh, above everybody else uh, in much the same way that the Nazis put Nordic people above everybody else and regarded all other nations and races as untermenschen, uh, subhuman. Uh, the Zionists regard everybody who is not Jewish as animals. When we're out these marches sometimes we see comparisons being made between Israel and the Nazis. What do you think of those kind of comparisons? That's completely accurate actually because what the Nazis used to do was gas people up. What are the Israelis doing right now? Yeah exactly. This is the, this is the same behavior that Nazis took towards Jews living in Europe. This idea that oh we just you know we're just defending against bad people or other things like that and at the same time funneled, funneled Jews into ghettos in the same way they've basically boxed Palestinians into Gaza. What was your initial reaction on the 7th of October when Hamas invaded Israel? What did you think first? To be honest, I've seen a lot of evidence online also that the 7th of October event actually was created. Huh? There's videos of the parachuters two and a half years ago in Egypt taking place. Right. So, and then it's like, I had somebody in Palestine that they said, that if anything happens in Palestine, let's say a little altercation, the IDF come within like one, two minutes. This one happened, they came after five, six hours. I've actually got a poster right now. Let me show you. Yeah. This is literally the similarities between the Nazis and Israel. Basically, you know, the Israeli military is too powerful, so they've got no choice but to attack civilians. That was the case, I think. What do you think should happen to all the Zionists that live in Israel right now? They need to leave because firstly, and they need to be punished for what they've done. When we're out here, we hear some people comparing Israel to the Nazis. I've seen a few pamphlets going around with like Netanyahu with a Hitler moustache. What do you think of those kind of comparisons? Um, it's true, because what he's doing, he's doing worse than what Hitler did. Just like Hitler killed innocent people is what Israel is doing in Hamas right now, killing innocent, innocent people. Can I ask you, what is a Zionist? A Zionist is an extremist Jew who supports the genocide of Israeli people, uh, of, sorry, who supports the genocide of Palestinian people. Basically they say we kidnapped 200 people or we beheaded babies when there was no proof. So, I mean, just to be clear, do you think it did happen or it didn't happen? To be honest, we don't know. We live, there's a hadith that the Prophet, peace be upon him, where the Prophet said that a time will come towards the end of time, where the time will be of deception. Yeah. He said that the most truthful individual will be considered the most. What, what about, what, what, do you know, maybe, obviously, you can tell me it's about like it. i give an example, like the beheaded baby story. Yeah. Where's the picture of it? Yeah. So where's the picture, you know, where's the bodies, where's the national funeral gone? You know, where's anything? Yeah. You don't see anything like that.